What's going on guys, Dylan DeJesus here, and today we're gonna to be walking you through a last minute Christmas gift guide for that special customizer in your life. We wanted to do things a little bit outside the norm, try to find some items that aren't your typical, go buy them some paint, go buy them some base shoes. We wanted to try to find some cool accessories that you might have seen us use in other videos or talk about, or just some new stuff that I've tried out recently that I think a lot of customizers would really enjoy. Also, we're gonna be giving away a pretty sweet bundle of some of these items featured in today's video so make sure you stick around to the end for details on that. So first off, we have the paint puck. I think every customizer is always looking for the perfect solution for not only brush storage, but a way to properly clean them and maintain them, and this solves all of those issues. This is made out of a really soft, nice silicone material. It holds up to nearly 30 brushes, and as you could tell, you could fit a lot of different size handle brushes within here in these inner and outer rings. But the real magic is at the bottom of the cup here with these puck nubs, and what you're gonna be able to do here is wipe away any additional paint that you have on your bristles since they're nice and soft it's actually going to maintain your brush shape you don't have anything to worry about there you're not hitting it up against a really hard surface and then you have these squeegee lips on top to wipe away any of that wetness and then you're able to store your brushes right on the outside and then we have a little bit of a drip tray at the bottom to catch any of that wetness coming off the brush. So I've been using this product for about three months now. Brush maintenance is something that I've never really been very good at, but this is a great solution. I've always just had a simple solo cup nearby and just left my brushes in the wet, dirty water. And then just when things got really bad, I would boil them in water. I would never really do any preventative maintenance for the brushes. And this is gonna go a long way in really helping you maintain the life of your brushes, make them last longer, pour a little bit of money into some nicer quality brushes, and this is gonna help you maintain them for the long run. All right, and our next item is going to be the Anchor Soundcore Life Q20s. Everybody's always looking for a great pair of noise canceling headphones. Apple just dropped a $550 pair of AirPods Max. That is probably going to be a little bit out of most people's price range for some headphones, but this is a great budgetary option. These are going to be $60, they have 40 hours of playtime. The noise cancellation on these is absolutely insane. As a customizer, sometimes you really want to lock in, you want to zone everything out, you really want to turn on that noise cancellation mode. Just get in your zone and these will really help you do it. I love my AirPods. One issue that I always run into with those is that they have not great battery life. You only get a few hours out of them. It feels like I hardly ever have to charge these and that is a great feature about these. So I think at $60, you might be thinking that you might not be getting the best build quality or sort of what's the catch here, but these are super comparable to some of the other higher end over the ear wireless Bluetooth headphones like some of the Sony WH, whatever their long name is. These come with a little travel bag. The comfortability on these is epic and the Bluetooth connectivity is huge. I like to hop between devices. Sometimes I'm listening to something on my iPhone or my iPad, my computer, whatever the case may be. And with a lot of Bluetooth headphones, sometimes you have to turn them off, reconnect them to the device and this, it saves it right on there. You're able to hop from device to device so it comes in clutch. Overall, I just give these a really high recommendation. I was definitely very skeptical in the beginning about these at this price range, but after using them for about six months now, these are definitely worth the price. Next up, we have a set of Zem detail brushes. Now, depending on availability, these might come in a four or a five pack on Amazon, but these are a super fine detail brush. Diving into portraits more this year and incredibly detailed work. These are some of my go-to. These are also at a great price point too. You're gonna to be able to pick up a pack of these for under $15 and you're gonna get a couple different sizes, usually about a five over zero, 10 over zero, and 20 over zero. You're also gonna get a couple different bristle lengths, depending on how long you like your bristle, if you like it a little bit longer or a little bit shorter, along with the various sizes. So this is a great little pack. These are a pretty high quality synthetic liner brush. I'm a really big fan of these. And then like I said, with me diving more into portraits this year, these have definitely been uh, in heavy rotation. Another great thing about these is that these are usually going to be a little bit of a finer brush than you would typically find in a value pack of a starter brush kit 
whether it be from, you know, a classic craft store like Michael's or Hobby Lobby, whatever the case may be, working with the finest detail brush is definitely gonna come in handy for you. And you also might be wondering, hey, can I just use a toothpick for all of my fine lining and all of my detail work? And although that certainly works about 90% of the time for a lot of my detail work that you've probably seen me do, when it comes to blending on things like portraits, these are definitely gonna be your go-to. Next up, we have a brush cleaner and preserver. And like I said, in the past, I'm somebody who hasn't done the best job at really taking care of my brushes, but a solution like this is gonna go a long way to really help you keep that shape for the long run. The last thing you want is for your brushes to end up looking like this, where you no longer have any of that shape. All of those bristles are totally frayed. It's no longer doing the job because some of those little frayed bristles that are gonna pick up paint are then gonna end up in spots that you don't want them to be. You also just really start to lose that elegance of working with a really clean, well-maintained brush when you have a brush that ends up looking like it has bed head. It's no longer as fun to use for sure. So in order to use this product, all you need to do is first rinse off your brush. You're then going to rub it on top of the solution, create a little bit of a lather. You're gonna then go ahead and let that sit for a bit if you're trying to reshape it. And then after it's sort of dried up a bit, you're gonna go ahead and run it back through some water, rinse it all off, and then it is going to be restored back to its original shape a whole lot more than it was. So for 2021, let's go ahead and make it all of our missions to take better care of our brushes with a product like this. All right. And next up, we have a product I am super excited to share with you guys. So when we were coming up with ideas for this video, trying to think of gifts for customizers a little bit outside the box, I thought it would be super cool to make a product like this, something that is customizable for the special customizer in your life. As you can tell here, we have the At De Jesus Custom Footwear laser engraved on this shoelace display. Now there's five hooks on here. You'll be able to store anywhere from 25 up to 75 laces on a shoelace rack like this. I'm super excited about this, guys. You guys have probably seen my massive shoelace collection in the past, I understand. A lot of people probably don't have anywhere near as many laces as that, and a lot of times they just end up in an extra box or something like that. But now we have a solution for that, something that also not only is going to help you store your laces, sort them out, whether it be by color or length, whatever the case may be, but it also makes for a super cool display. So this one's actually a bit of a collaboration with my wife, Brittany. She runs an awesome woodworking laser engraving business and she came up with this entire file this design and it's a really cool solution for all customizers so you're going to be able to get your name your business whatever you want engraved on the top here we went ahead and threw the just create branding on there to really bring some color and vibrancy to this display piece and we're just super excited to share this with you guys also included is going to be a bundle of 10 sets of laces we are going to be keeping this to a limited edition run. There is only going to be 25 units made of these. So if you're interested, please feel free to check out that link down below. And our final item for those of you who might be working with a little bit of a bigger budget who are looking to seriously upgrade some of the tech in your studio, we have here the 12.9 inch iPad Pro. This is an absolute game changer of not only a display, but a workflow in a customizer studio, whether it be using Procreate to do a lot of your mock-up work or opening apps like Lightroom, Photoshop, anything else in the Adobe suite, doing it on here, you can do so much with a tablet like this. This just about replaces the need for a desktop computer nowadays. Apple totally knocked it out of the park with some of the upgrades we've seen to the iPad over the past couple years. The joy of working with this iPad pencil takes you back to your early days, just playing around sketching, colored pencils, whatever. It really just has this great physical feel that you don't get when you're using a mouse and doing mock-ups on a computer. There's something just so beautiful about working with this Apple Pencil. And for anybody who happens to use a Cricut vinyl cutter, the Cricut Design Space is available from the App Store. So that's awesome that you can do all of your designing and your wireless printing directly from your tablet. You no longer need a computer to do that. That's pretty sweet. Hopefully, in the not too distant future, they will uh, have Silhouette Studio available from the App Store because I'm somebody who has used the Silhouette product line, the Cameos, for many years now. So I would love for them to add Silhouette Studio to the iPad. 
Also with this massive display, works great as a little bit of a media center directly on your workspace. I watch movies all the time while I'm painting. Some people like to just have podcasts or music on in the background. Whatever the case may be, you're definitely gonna be able to do all of that directly from here. So as mentioned earlier in the video, here is our giveaway bundle. We have the paint puck, the Anchor Soundcore headphones, the Zem detail brushes, and the brush cleaner and preserver. All you need to do in order to enter this giveaway is make sure to like the video, make sure you're subscribed to the page, and go ahead and comment which of these four items you would like most down below in the comments, and we will be announcing the winner to the giveaway next week on our Instagram, so make sure you're following us over there at DeHazes Custom Footwear. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully everybody has a safe, happy holiday season. We appreciate your guys' continued support here on YouTube. Make sure you go ahead and give this video a like if you enjoyed what you saw today. Make sure you're subscribed, and we'll see you guys in that next video.